Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing just a plain brown smoky eye. It's super easy, so if you want to learn how, just keep on watching. As always, I'm priming my face with a Smashbox Photo Finish Primer. And I'm just applying that all over my T-zone and just the rest of my face so my foundation stays all day. Then for the eyes, I'm just using the Urban Decay Primer Potion and applying that all over my eyelids and also under my lower lash line. Next, I'm taking the HD Illuminating Beauty Balm from Stila and I'm just applying it all over my face for really dewy skin. And I'm just getting my fingers and applying it really where I want to be extra glowy, just around my eyes under them around my nose and also up around my forehead next I'm taking my matte concealer and this is in the shade NC 15 and I'm just applying that on all the places that I have problem areas around my cheeks and also around the redness of my nose and anywhere where I just have breakouts For foundation, I'm taking my Studio Fix Fluid in the shade MC15 and I'm applying that on the back of my hand and just dabbing it all over my face for even coverage. And then to blend it out, I'm just taking my Beauty Blender and just dabbing that all over my face and blending it all out. And then for my under eye concealer, I'm going in with the Kat Von D Lock It Tattoo Concealer and applying that under my eyes and taking my Beauty Blender and blending it all in. For my highlight, I'm taking Light Boost from MAC and I'm just going to be highlighting under my eyes on the bridge of my nose and also on my cupid's bow, a little bit on my forehead, and under my chin. I know it's a lot, but it really makes all the look come together and makes it just look absolutely flawless. Set everything, I'm just going in with my MAC Mineralize Powder and I'm just applying them all the places where we applied the highlighter and the foundation and also around my neck. And then for my brows, I'm taking my Anastasia Dip Brow in Chocolate and just going in with a Sigma Angled Brush. I'm just going to be applying that under my eyebrows and really shaping them and also very lightly filling them in. Set it all in place, I'm just taking my Anastasia Clear Brow Gel and applying that all over the brows. For bronzer, I'm just going to be taking my NARS Laguna and applying that on my cheekbones and also around my temples for a really bronzy skin. 
Then for my contour, I'm just going to be taking this brush and also the Hula Bronzer from Benefit and outlining my cheekbones and really deepening up them and just giving a very nice contour. This brush is from one of the Physician Formulas bronzer and it works really, really awesome for a contour. I'm also applying that on my temples, under my lip, and also around the, my nose just to really contour everything and make your face look slimmer. Then I'm just blending everything out with an angled brush. For my blush, I'm going to be taking Orgasm from NARS and applying that on the apples of my cheek and also above my cheekbones. And then also, to just lighten it more up and make it, our cheeks look a lot more rosy, I'm going in with this Physicians Formula Blush. And this is in the shade Natural and just applying that over the other blush. Then for the final touches, I'm just taking this Bronze Booster from Physicians Formula and applying that on all the places that we contoured and put bronzer on. Highlight, I'm just taking this Shading Classic from one of the Too Faced palettes and applying that up on my cheekbones. This is a beautiful, beautiful highlight. I just started using it. It's an eyeshadow, but it works great as a highlight. And then always, I'm applying the What's Up from Benefit over my Cupid's bow just for a really glowy look. For our eyes today, we're going to be going in with this BH Cosmetics palette and just taking this light brown, applying it with a blending brush in the crease as a transition color. And then going in with this angle brush from Sigma, we're just going to be taking this burgundy tone color and applying it over that light, light brown and just blending it upwards and this really warms up the eyes and just gives it an extra pop of glow and makes it look very, very beautiful. Then going in with the Too Faced Natural Eye Palette, we're going to take Sexpresso and apply it with our Sigma pencil brush into the crease and also on the outer V. And then going in with my Sigma blending brush, I'm just going to be blending out that dark brown and making it really, really smoky, but you want to take your time on this just so you can get the best effect. For my lid, I'm just taking this color called Peach from Sephora and applying that all over my lids just for a really glow. It's kind of like a champagne color, but it's got really like pops of shimmer in it and it's absolutely gorgeous. And then I'm going in with Sin from Urban Decay and just applying that to the center of my lids for an extra pop. And then to clean up my eyeshadow, I'm just taking this matte concealer and my concealer brush and just making the edges really sharp. Then going in with that light brown color, I'm applying that to my lower lash line and applying Sexpresso also and just smoking everything out. Then going in with my Stila eyeliner in Starfish, I'm applying that to the lower lash line. The next I'm taking this cream color and applying it as my brow highlight. <laughs> For my eyeliner, I'm taking the Stila Style Day Waterproof Liquid Eyeliner and winging my eyeliner out. And it's also a lot easier to wing your eyeliner whenever you clean up the eyeshadow with the concealer. That way you've got the perfect straight line already there as you can see. Then 
after you get done with eyeliner, be sure to apply mascara. My camera did not record me putting on mascara or my lips. So for lips, I'm going in with Max Syrup and also Chelsea Girls from NARS and then a little bit of Nectar Sweet from MAC over top of it and that is all for the lips. I hope you guys enjoyed this look. Be sure to subscribe to my channel, like this video, and also share. I love you guys and I will talk to you later.